Welcome to my YouTube video. It's Ivy here and oh my goodness. I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I posted my last video which was my first YouTube video and if you watched that video, if you commented, if you subscribed, if you shared anything at all, it means so much to me. Like you guys have no idea. When you start something new, it's so fragile. You want that feedback. And any form of attention just makes you so happy. You feel like people are actually paying attention. Especially for something like YouTube that has a lot to do with engagement. Any form of activity, any form of attention you guys showed my video, it means so much to me. By the way, it takes a lot to start anything. Especially if it's something you've never done before, it takes a lot. If you paid any form of attention to my video, it means so much to me and you have no idea it fuels you to keep going let's keep that momentum let's keep it going and it's only going to get better i have so much plans for this channel and it's only going to get better from here so thank you thank you for all the support i mean i don't know how many times have i said thank you just drink every time i say thank you you might as well get drunk tonight just after i was done filming filming the intro my battery died so <laughs> I had to go get that charge. I also had to have supper. I'm back now. I'm back with a food baby, but that's okay. No excuses in 2020. We're doing what needs to be done. I'm back now, ready to film this video. So basically, I will try on things I will never wear from my wardrobe. These things are not scary looking or anything. They just don't give me that mm, when I wear them. That's why I've never worn them out. So yes, we'll try them out. Maybe I'll do a giveaway. If this video gets to 20,000 views in two months, I'll do a giveaway. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and try these things on. I really need to do better. I don't know why I keep swiping my credit card for things I'm not even head over heels for. <laughs> I got this dress like two years ago I don't know what to do with this dress like okay okay I don't know this dress can be worn in summer because it has like really long sleeves it also can't be worn in winter because obviously it gets to like minus 40 where I leave. So I can't wear this in the winter. Maybe I can wear this in the spring and I don't know where to even wear this to. Maybe I can wear it to church. Maybe I can wear it to visit a queen in England. I don't know. Before you make a purchase, think of at least four, four places you can actually wear that out, outfit to. If you can't think of four places you can wear it to, just don't buy it. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't even make sense to buy something you can only wear to one place. And Instagram makes you feel like you have to wear things only once, but like, I don't make celeb money. Celebrities wear things just once and they make the money so they can actually afford to do that. I don't. I work a 9 to 5 job so I have to buy things that I can wear multiple times. Never ever ever take money out of your savings account to buy clothes. It's not worth it. I guarantee you it's not worth it. If you're about to do it, abort. If you don't like something, send it back. Don't keep it. Send it back. It's 2020. We're not taking any else. Like, I 
not today. This dress is not for me. It might be a nice dress, but it's not just. I finally know the reason why I'm never really satisfied Not today Like this dress is just funny looking Not today 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 I don't know what I was thinking or what I was expecting with this dress, but it's just not working. It's not for me. Just because it looks good on the model doesn't mean it will look good on me. Always keep your body type in mind when you go shopping. Okay, so this dress is okay. When it came in, it looked really funny. It had like extra large hips. I don't know who those hips were for because I don't have those kind of hips. I got this dress maybe summer so yes I will give this dress out I already had some work done to it so yes I'm just going to keep it so I can adjust it to my size I already used my sewing machine to get this dress fitted to my size but yeah outside of that it's an okay dress if you wear it in the summer next summer who knows we'll see buy things you are excited to wear immediately don't buy something you're not going to wear you'd probably just keep it in storage and admire them unless it's some couture dress where you just keep it in your room as a work of art you don't need that okay this dress is just too long i don't know it's supposed to be maybe a beach a beach cover up or just something you wear at the beach but it's too long probably look better on someone taller and it's too big also like look it's so big <laughs> I'm like swimming in it but yeah it's too long I don't know if you guys can see how long this is but it's like way too long and it has no shape for me it's just not for me look like it's falling London Bridge is falling down. It's falling. I don't know. I don't think it's supposed to be tight, but it's not supposed to be too big either. It's not a bad dress, honestly. The colors look nice. It just look better on someone else. Yeah, it's actually a nice material. Like, look at the colors. It's not bad, but someone else would wear it so much better. I'm just not the one for this dress. It's too big. Oh, I just have to give you guys a few tips so you don't end up in the same situation as I did. Tip number one. If it's not on sale then it's not for sale it means if it's not on sale put back your credit card in your wallet and just forget about it if you watched up until this point I'd like to know what your favorite shopping team is as this is actually not a bad dress it still has a tag on you Maybe it would look nice with a jacket, I don't know, but it's just very see-through. You can literally see my underwear from like 10 miles away. That's the problem I have with this dress. It's not a bad dress, it's just, oh, it's okay, it's okay, but if it wasn't so see-through, there is a lining, but the lining stops somewhere here. I have no idea why they just don't put the lining all the way down. Thank you guys so much for watching, but it's 12 a.m. here and I have to go to sleep. So I'll see you guys on my next video. Please do not forget to share, comment, and subscribe.